Just weeks after the district attorney reveals a problem in Hamilton County, schools are taking their own approach to prevent bullying. Brittany Martin joins us now with more on this story. Brittany. Josh, General Neil Pinkston released his report on a culture of hazing and bullying following the rape of an Ottawa High student by his teammates. Tonight, Hickson Middle School held an anti-bullying conference. I spoke with two students who've been bullied before and asked them if they think their school is doing enough. We're doing everything we can. We need your help. Educators pleading for help from parents. Tuesday night, Hickson Middle held an event to teach parents how to identify and talk to kids about bullying. Karen Glenn from Students Taking a Right Stand says the school system is committed to tackling this issue. I want you to know what the efforts are underway in this school to protect your child from bullying. Speakers explain everyone is required by law to report bullying or abuse. The school also told students they can remain anonymous by dropping notes into these boxes in each hallway. I thought it was like a really good message. Zai Hunter is a sophomore at Hickson High. She says she was once bullied and is confident in the new measures the school system is taking. Because like that kid could be on the verge of hurting themselves critically and then that one talk from that one person in their life that means a lot to them could help. Drew Dodge, another sophomore at Hickson High, says he's dealt with bullying for years. I was depressed every day and for a while. Both Zai and Drew say they found a teacher, friends, and a drama program that helps them deal with bullying. It feels empowering to know that you're like up here making a difference for everybody else and like you're not just being one solid voice in the crowd. Educators also ask parents to be mindful of their child's internet use and even music they like. They said pop culture can also serve as a form of bullying or peer pressure for teens. Josh. Brittany, thank you. Statistics show more than 70% of students are subjected to some sort of bullying in their teens.